Hi everyone, Mary Godfrey here. I'm at Baylight Institute for Creative Arts, the home office. We're located at 7th Street and Southern in Phoenix, Arizona. You're welcome to come and visit us. You can check us out online also, B-I-C-A-N-O-W, BicaNow.com. So here today I thought I would show you some beautiful artwork. Right behind me is a piece of glass. And the last few weeks we've had several people that have been in look at it and go, wow, and they think it's stained glass. Actually, in fact, it's not stained glass. It is painted glass. It is painted glass created by Debbie Panna. She's one of the teachers here at Paylight Institute. She has an upcoming class. It is not on the schedule yet, but you can watch for that. And in the meantime, I'm going to talk about copyrights today. That's the topic of the week. So I want to preface that with saying I am not a legal attorney. I am not an attorney of any kind. And if you have details for yourself that you need to find out, you are welcome to call legal attorneys here in Arizona as well as worldwide. There are many great attorneys throughout the country. that uh, I'm going to share with you some information that I have heard from legal attorneys at South by Southwest Conference and Music conference in Texas and the question of the week is if I am filing a copyright application can I include more than one piece of original works in one application and I'm going to clarify that for you now that is if I'm an artist and I want to submit images of my artwork for copyright can I include more than one in one application if I'm a musician I wrote a song and I want to send in copyright for some songs. Can I include more than one? The answer is yes. Also recommended by the attorney that I, along with a group of people at the conference that I was at, the attorney recommended limiting it though to three or four. And you might say, why limit it? Well the reason why is because one of the reasons why we do copyrights is for protection in the event there may be litigation. Litigation, you might ask. Well, litigation is a topic that comes up in copyright law and with attorneys and in the music industry. And on occasion, there have been incidences where songwriters have thought that their original works were taken by someone else. We have car insurance for the in cases in the event that somebody gets sued. And it's similar to that, the process of copyright. It's a protection process. Also, if someone is a songwriter and or an artist and there is a question uh, to look up that artist to give them royalties, if they should be due royalties, it's another reason why you want your copyrights. People can find you on the Register of Copyrights Library of Congress. So, if somebody is in litigation, and there was 20 items of original works in one body of copyright. It makes it more complicated. Limiting it to three or four makes it easier. So once again, the answer is yes, you can copyright more than one item of original works in one registration application, preferably, according to an attorney that I heard in Texas, limit that to three or four. So I thank you for being here today. For your future questions, feel free to email me at mary at beaconnow.com. Mary, M-A-R-Y, at beaconnow.com. And in the meantime, remember, remember to be creative, uh, bring creativity into everything you do, whether it's business, art, or in the kitchen. Signing off from Arizona. Bye-bye now.